In a small corner of the world, on the Yucatan, once flourished a vast civilization. Most of our popular understanding about Mesoamerican cultures revolves around beliefs of sun worship, human sacrifice, and is symbolized by tourist destinations like Chichen Itza. However, the world of the Mayans was more complex and far-reaching than these two-dimensional stereotypes. This ancient culture had an understanding of time and astronomy that rivals the latest discoveries we have today. My concept of time uh, is in a way very advanced. The, the word they use is nasht, and that means space-time. They saw the, the fourth the four-dimensionality of time centuries, if not millennia, before we did. In order to track human existence, the Mayans had a series of interlocking calendars. Based on precise celestial observations, the passage of time was recorded and mapped on a cosmic clock of sorts. The many calendars worked together like gears, tracking events of the past and predicting those of the future. Each one of the gears has a special purpose. Two of the central cogs in the system, and the most important to the Mayans, comprised the Tzolkin calendar. The Tzolkin calendar has 260 days, which is determined by combining a cycle of 13 with a cycle of 20. A total of 260-day combinations will elapse before the cycle starts over again. While much of the Tzolkin calendar and its meaning remain shrouded in mystery, it is certain that the calendar was sacred and used for divination. It seems very suitable, apparently, for astrology, those who are astrologically inclined. The glyphs are gorgeous. In fact, it is often referred to as the sacred calendar. Beyond the Tzolkin, there is yet another outer gear called the Hob. Larger in size, but smaller in meaning, the Hob is 365 days long. Every year has 360 days plus five days out of time the exact length of our modern calendar year. Combined, the Tzolkin and the Hob correspond to a period of 18,980 days. This 52-year cycle is known as the calendar round. In order to document even longer periods of time, the Mayans use the long count calendar. It takes 5,126 years for the cycle to complete and restart. According to the Mayans, we are living in the fourth cycle of human existence that began on August 11, 3114 BCE and will end on December 21, 2012 CE when, like other calendars, it will reset. That's 12-21-12 and that's um, when the, the sun eclipses the dark rift at the center of the Milky Way galaxy on the winter solstice and that's the end of a great cycle for them and the beginning of another. The advent of each new cycle is thought to be a time for the gods to improve on their creation, and so they destroy civilization. The cyclical gears of the calendars work together the way the Mayans conceived of the universe, birth, death, and rebirth. What will happen when these cosmic gears reset on December 21st, 2012?